Hi you guys, um, today I'm going to talk about how crickets are really, 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 really evil and how I came to the conclusion that they actually control time. Okay, <laughs> yeah, it's kind of, it sounds kind of weird, but it'll make sense after this. I'm very, very, very sure of it. Alright, well, to... Okay, <laughs> I'm going to explain the whole story so that you guys can get what I mean about crickets being evil and controlling time. First of all, before I start the story, you need to know two things about me. One, I have a phobia of dead bugs. Um, I don't know why, but every time I see a bug, I do not kill it, no matter what it is, no matter if it's going to eat me and kill me, or it, or whatever. I'd rather it be alive and living <laughs> than actually, like, for me to actually kill it. Um, and it's not because I'm all, you know, oh, bugs are people too, or whatever, but it's because, um, I feel like if I kill bugs, they're, well, first of all, bugs are really, really smart, so if I kill a bug, either I didn't really kill it, because every time you kill a bug, you don't really kill bugs, like they're immortal or something, um, I didn't really kill it, and it's going to come for revenge, or, like, it's other bug family saw me, and it's also going to come for revenge, so, um, I'm really actually nice to bugs, I just kind of like, have a little talk in my head with them. I'm like, if I don't hurt you, you won't hurt me. If I don't hurt you, you won't hurt me. And it actually works. Um, I've sat like where there's a lot of ants and stuff and they never bite me or anything. And when I was little, when I used to kill ants and stuff, they would bite me a lot. So it kind of does work. <laughs> I guess if you're nice to bugs, they'll be nice too. And my second fear is um, little things that jump. So yeah, this includes bugs that jump or anything that jumps that's so little that you don't like you don't even notice when it's going to jump. It scares me because when I know that something has the ability to jump and I don't know if it's going to like jump at any time because they do it so spontaneously, they're just like and like I look at a bug that jumps and I'm just like waiting it for it to jump at me and like go into my hair or something, I don't know. Yeah, it, it kind of makes sense. I just don't like things that jump. I'd rather than me, I don't know, flying around or something or just walking. If it walks, I know that it's on the floor. If it flies, I know that it's somewhere on the air. But if it jumps, like, it can crawl, it can jump, and it can freaking be anywhere in the whole world or something. I don't know. It just... I don't like things to jump. So, in other words, I'm really, really, really scared of crickets. Yeah, cr crickets don't even do anything. Like, the worst thing that they can do is either eat your clothes or freaking, like, pee on you. And I know this because when I was smaller, I used to, like, catch crickets in plastic bags and what they would do is just pee on you and stuff. <laughs> but anyways, um, I know for a fact that crickets can't do anything to me, but I'm really scared of them because they can jump. Yeah, I don't know. It's it's just, I don't know. I like other bugs. I like spiders. Spiders mind their own business. They just stay there in their spidery webs and stuff. Um, Any other bug just minds their own business, but crickets, crickets are fucking evil. Okay, first of all, they do not let you sleep, and then they just jump at you, and then they eat your clothes, and then they're just evil little maniacs, I swear. I just hate them, they're so bleh. <laughs> Anyways, it all started yesterday, which was the worst morning of my life. And only morning, because then my day got better. But anyways, it was the worst morning of my life. Because I met a cricket who controls time. And I'm not even kidding about this. It is true. Okay, so I woke up in the morning all happily and... Well, actually, no, I was not happily. I was, like, really, really, really tired. Because I would go to work at 
freaking 5 a.m. Who is going to be happy at that time? So anyway, since I'm a girl, of course, I wake up at 4 a.m. because I have to get my pretty little hair ready. So anyways, I wake up, uh, uh, and I go into my bathroom, and I start taking my clothes off because I'm going to shower. And I see a fucking little cricket there looking at me like, I'm gonna jump at you and eat you, bitch. So, I get fucking scared, and I'm already naked, and I start screaming, and like, my mom wakes up, and she's like, what's wrong? I'm like, mommy, there's a cricket. And she comes with those fly swap thingies that you kill flies with, and she's like, where's the cricket? I'm like, it's over there. But of course, the cricket is gone, and my mom just looks at me like, you're crazy, I'm gonna go back to sleep, it's fucking 4 a.m. So, I'm there, like, all panicky, taking off my clothes and, like, opening the shower and everything really, really fast. And I see it again, and I scream, and I scream, and then my mom comes, and again, the cricket is gone, because that's how smart crickets are. <sighs> so then I shower, and while I'm showering, I'm, like, really, really panicky, I'm, like, naked and fear and stuff, and I'm like, oh my god, the cricket's gonna eat me, it's gonna jump at me, it's gonna be in my hair, it's gonna eat me Even though crickets don't eat people. Well, they control time, so I guess they could eat people. Anyways, um, so I get out of my shower, and, you know, I'm changing and blah blah, and of course I'm, like, naked again and putting on my underwear and stuff, and then I see it right there next to me. And, of course, I start screaming for help once again, and my mom comes with the fly swap thingy, and she finally catches it, and she's finally going to kill it, and I'm about to throw up because I don't like dead bugs, and I didn't want her to kill it, but, you know, with normal bugs, you can just, like, put them somewhere and just let them free or something. But no, with crickets, you can't because they fucking jump and you can't really, like, yeah, no. Okay, so I'm there all panicking, I'm like, oh my god, it's gonna kill it, now it's gonna be dead, and now it's going to look for revenge. And as soon as she's about to swap it, the cricket just looks at me like, this. you're gonna pay for this. And then, Mrr! and it fucking fast forwards time, I swear. It fast forward time. Okay, so then my mom kills it, and she throws it in the freaking, like, trash can of my, like, bathroom. And I'm like, I'm about to throw up, seriously, I, ugh, I just really hate bugs that are dead. And I'm like, oh my god, that's so really gross, blah, blah. and all wimpy and stuff. So then, um, I just change really fast and do my hair really fast. Well, actually, no. I'm just changing really fast, and then, um, I'm just scared because it's in my bathroom thing, trash can, and I'm like, it's gonna jump out at any minute, and it's not gonna be dead, and I'm gonna die. And <laughs> so then, um, my mom is like, Oh my god, the sun is rising! I'm like, how can the sun be rising? It's freaking 4 a.m. So then, I go out, and I'm like, what do you mean the sun is rising? And I look at the clock, and it's freaking 5.30 a.m. And I was supposed to go to work at 5, okay? And I was, like, I'm not even kidding. I woke up at 4, and I never take that long. I swear I did not take that long in the shower or anything. It's freaking fast forward time. So then I'm like, oh my god, I'm gonna be late to work. I'm actually already late. What am I gonna do? So I just do a really quick ponytail and I don't know, just throw stuff on me and then just like leave in my car. And I'm like, just like all panicky. I'm like, what am I going to tell my supervisor? He's going to kill me. So <laughs> then my mom like checks her alarm clock thing and she's like oh my god the alarm was set at 5 15 and i'm like dude that is not true it was set at four like four and 5 15 have nothing to do with each other like can't you know i couldn't have made a mistake like that you know so i'm like oh my god what the hell and i go to my work and i'm like all rushing up the stairs and all Ugh! And I'm all sweating because it's hot and I'm running and stuff. And I get there and my supervisor isn't even there. He didn't go to work. So I'm like, who am I going to tell they arrived late? I arrived 55 minutes late. And I just like 
got everything ready and started working and stuff. And then, like, later on, I just talked to another person, and then she talked to other people, and they let me stay, like, 55 minutes after my shift, and I don't know, it got fixed. But I swear to you, the cricket fucking fast forward time. It wanted revenge on me because I told my mom to kill it. Well, no, but I was the one that screamed for help so that the cricket could leave me alone. And I swear to you that the cricket, like, before it was going to die, it looked at me like, you're going to pay for this. And it fast forward time. So, yeah, be careful with cricket. Yeah, I don't know. And then, like, after coming to this conclusion, I'm like, do crickets even sleep, dude? Like, at night, they're all singing their little cricket song, which is actually probably like a magic spell or something to fucking control time. And, um, and then, like, I saw the cricket in the morning, so shouldn't they sleep, like, at daytime or something? I don't know. Do they sleep? Do they not sleep? Crickets just fucking confuse me, too. Like, I don't know. They're so gross and weird and evil. Seriously. I'd just rather be, see, like, a cockroach or something than a cricket. So yeah, that's my story. Has something like you have, like this ever happened to you? Um, do you think any other bug or animal is evil? Do you think any other bug has superpowers? If you know something about this, something about a bug that has superpowers or can control time or can do some weird somersault ninja things in the air, then please comment it or tell me about it. I mean, I want to know. I want to be warmed about this. So next time I get ready for work and I see a fucking cricket, I'm going to look at the time and I'm going to be like, okay, if someone kills this cricket, it is this time, and if it fast forwards time, I'm going to have proof of crickets controlling time. <sighs> so yeah, <laughs> I'm in my pajamas right now, I'm actually in my Shane Dawson shirt. <laughs> Because it's my day off work, and yeah, um, but yeah, like I said, the rest of my day was really nice, actually. I saw Brave, and I'm going to do, like, a little review on the movie, and I really loved it, and, um, what else did I do? Nothing, pretty much, I saw Brave, I slept, I drank tea, and I ate french fries. You know, just regular day. So, yeah, <laughs> how's your weekend? How's your day off? How's your life. Please tell me about it. I'm very bored. <laughs> but yeah, anyways, um, thank you for watching this video. This is Mila Stench, and I hope you have a nice weekend. Um, a nice weekend that doesn't have any crickets or anything. <laughs> Bye!